so today's video is going to be on this makeup look that I currently have on. It's a purple smoky eye with a bold ombre purple lip as well. I really really love this look and this was actually the look that um, I was supposed to put up on my Instagram for my 7 days of makeup challenge. This was meant to be the 7th day look so the last day um but i couldn't post it like i said because i didn't get like good quality pictures um so i didn't post it but um, i asked you guys if you guys like to see a tutorial and a lot of people like from my facebook page and instagram said they would like to see a tutorial and so here it is i hope you guys like this video it's very very fun and it's a very bold and colorful look and of course you can switch the lip to a nude lip or maybe um use like don't use like uh, purple glitter or something you know just kind of switch it up to make it work for you but it's a very very beautiful look i absolutely love it um yeah so i hope you guys like it too and if you do please thumbs up this video and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and follow me on snapchat um instagram facebook tumblr twitter I usually show like uh tutorials on my looks and you know sneak peeks, previews, and stuff of my looks that are coming on YouTube. If you like that, follow me on Snapchat. I'll leave all of my links somewhere here in the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you all so, so much for watching, and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye! So you want to just start off by priming your eyelids. I'm using my Black Radiance Perfecting Eyeshadow Primer. And after this, I'm just going into my Morphe 350 palette and I'm using this fluffy brush from BH Cosmetics and I'm buffing in this neutral brown eyeshadow in my crease. And I'm going in with this warm orange eyeshadow. It's kind of like a pure orange eyeshadow actually. And I'm just applying this in my crease as well. Now I'm going into my BH Cosmetics 120 palette and I'm just applying this purple eyeshadow in my crease. I end up switching my brush to a smaller more dense um, eyeshadow brush just because I wanted a more intense application in my crease so I wanted to dip in the purple and so I used a smaller brush okay now I'm going back into the Morphe 3501 I'm just applying this white eyeshadow matte white eyeshadow to my brow bone to highlight the brow bone and I'm going into this deeper um, eggplant looking purple shade and I'm just placing this into my crease basically to kind of cut the crease and then I go back in with the blend inside and I just blend everything out to make sure the line is not like super harsh. And I just take the eyeshadows a little upwards towards my um, brow bone just to blend everything out. And I'm applying the same purple eyeshadow that I used first on my eyelids just to serve as a base for my um, glitter. Now I'm using this glitter from NYX. I don't remember the name but I'll list it in the description box. And it's just like a purple glitter with like... Um, silver reflexes in it it's really cool anyways I'm applying some eyelash glue on my eyes and then I'm just going to pack on the glitter using a fluffy brush now I'm priming my face using the Tushy Cloud primer from YSL and I did my foundation and highlighting off camera I just uploaded an updated version so I'll link it in the description box for you guys now I'm just applying this blush from Sephora it's called Tangerine Tees and I'm just using a fluffy brush from e.l.f. to apply this on my cheeks now I'm grabbing this um, black liner from LA Girl and I'm just going to be lining my waterline just to kind of intensify the eye look and give it a more dramatic effect. Now I'm going back in with a purple eyeshadow that I used earlier and then I'm going to just blend out my crease. No, sorry, I'm going to blend out my waterline just to smudge out the black that I applied so it's not too harsh. Now after that, I'm going to be going in with my City Colors Be Bold Mascara and I'm just applying this to my um, bottom lashes. This mascara is really really good and it's so affordable as well. To make sure my foundation and highlights and everything stays in place all day, I'm just going to spray my face using my Smashbox Primer Water. Now we're moving on to the lips and I'm going to be going into my um, BH Cosmetics 28 color lip palette and I'm just applying this deep red um, shade to the outer corners of my lips and then I'm going in with this pink magenta um, color and I'm just going to apply this to the center of my eye eyelids, the center of my lips sorry and then I'm just going to blend it in with the um, deeper red shade. After that I'm going in with a baby pink color. And I'm also going to apply it to the center of my lips and then I'm going in with a lighter nude 
and I'm applying it directly on top of the um, baby pink color. So I'm just going to mix everything together and as you can see it gives me a very nice ombre effect. So this is a finished look everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As you can see the look is actually quite simple but it's a very very fun colorful look for spring and summer and I absolutely love it. I hope you guys like it too. Please thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you all in my next video. Have a wonderful week. Bye!